Hello, embedded engineers, developers, and professionals in the embedded computing design world. Welcome to, in case you missed it, Embedded Insights, the weekly news show all about the embedded technologies and solutions that you need to know from embedded computing design. Mm, that coffee's good today. It is Friday, August 22nd, 2025. It's almost back to school time, a celebratory time for all of us parents. It's almost Labor Day weekend time for everyone in the US to celebrate. And I am Ken Briota, Editor-in-Chief of Embedded Computing Design and your host. These are our top stories. First up, QNX has launched its brand new QNX operating system for safety 8.0. It's the 8.0 edition of QoS. This Foundational safety certified solution is built on the microkernel architecture of QNX SDP 8.0. And the company said that it is designed to streamline the development and certification of both safety and security critical embedded systems like those found in automotive, industrial, robotics, medical devices, and defense sectors. The embedded OS wars continue. Our next story comes from Analog Devices. The company has brought us a guest article column exploring how inertial sensing improves precision and productivity in smart farming operations, especially in the areas of navigation and stability for self-steering tractors, picking robots, drones, and those kinds of automated robotics solutions, but also for edge sensing modalities like animal tracking, detecting heat in dairy animals for making sure that they're healthy and you know doing well, and vital sign monitoring. Uh, so go ahead and give that a read. It's really interesting. Finally, we are featuring Macronix, which has announced its brand new Armor Boot MX76, a NOR flash memory designed to support performance and security features that improve boot times and data protection. The company says it's ready for demanding applications like AI, IoT, and automotive electronics, so it's ready to rock and roll for whatever your use case might be, so feel free to check that out. And that's it for this week. Make sure you look for the In Case You Missed It LinkedIn newsletter for even more stories that you don't want to miss that comes out every single Monday. One little update that you need to know, In Case You Missed It, will be off next week for the Labor Day holiday here in the U.S. Support your local union. We will be back on Friday, September 5th. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel, which you may very well be on right now, so you don't miss any of our shows and click that little notification bell because we go up every week with In Case You Missed It, Dev Kit Weekly, although that's currently on a hiatus, and all of our other shows. Visit embeddedcomputing.com for all the news in the embedded computing space and follow us on LinkedIn and all across the web. Please reach out if you'd like to advertise on this show In Case You Missed It or any of our shows, and I will see you in September. I've been Ken Briota, Editor-in-Chief of Embedded Computing Design and your host, and hope you all have a marvelous weekend.